Four tragedies all at the same location. The Skyline Towers. In three months, two toddlers have died after falling from high floors in the building, and a third toddler was hurt. Lareb Zaidi still sees her son's broken body every time she closes her eyes, and it's been just over two months since the toddler fell from the 26th floor. Our Bruce Lachan just talked with the Zaidis, and they're demanding that the apartment managers do more to keep kids safe. A warning to you tonight, this story is disturbing. I was trying to lift, lift him up, but I can't, and the blood was coming out of his mouth. The day three-year-old Syed Zaidi fell through the window screen in his parents' 26th floor apartment, his mother raced downstairs in hopes of a miracle. That scene always come in front of my eyes. The day he, he, his, he is gone, I can't sleep in the nights. Syed died on May 30th. On Monday, another child was killed after climbing over the balcony railing just two floors below the Zaidi's apartment. And three years ago, a little girl miraculously survived after falling through a window on the fifth floor of the very same building. What did they do after the first incident? What did they do after the second incident? What did they do after the third incident? Are we waiting for another one? The Zaidis just sued the managers of Skyline Towers, demanding $100 million for alleged negligence and Syed's wrongful death. The Skyline Towers and Equity Residential Properties declined to comment on the lawsuit, but the companies have offered their thoughts and prayers to the families. It's not about the money. The family says it is just trying to warn other parents and push the companies to do more to keep children safe. I don't want this, hap this thing happen to any other child. The Zaidis say that the least the building's managers here could do is put a label on the window screens here to warn parents that they are not designed to keep children from falling. In Falls Church, Bruce Lashan, WUSA 9. It's just an unthinkable tragedy. Now, the current Virginia building code requires that windows only open four inches if they're within a child's easy reach. But Skyline Towers was built in the 70s, and the building code doesn't mandate that owners bring apartments up to the current standard.